everybody. We're back. My next guest tonight is a frequent performer at the Riviera Comedy Club in Las Vegas, and he's just completed his first world tour. Please welcome a man who's made a lot of people laugh for a very long time, Mr. Rich Hall. Rich. <laughs> So I'm right, you, uh, what's the matter? No, it's there's just a weird buzz around here. It's just what are weird. you talking about? It's just, there's the tension, excitement. Well, we're excited to see you. you Thank know, you. You've had yeah. a long, illustrious yeah. career. Hi, everybody. And... There you go. <laughs> yes, I have. I've been around the world. Yeah, world tour. Uh, Australia, mm -hmm. New Zealand. I could go on and on with you know, the crap, the crap uh, thing would be to say, oh, the British are different than Americans, but they're not really. They're all, it's all the same except for one thing, British die with dignity that's the thing about it. when the they British die people die dignity. they just die with dignity uh in the obituaries all the obituaries in all the papers in England everybody in the obituaries dies either peacefully or suddenly <laughs> I said, really Florida Williams passed away peacefully <laughs> or suddenly you know <laughs> which is not although there must be other ways to die you know I think mm -hmm. like you ought to match up to your gas tank to see if it was empty you know <laughs> you die spectacularly then <laughs> <laughs> That's shoot right. But it's either peacefully or suddenly. Uh huh. I see. Actually, I guess it's possible to die both peacefully and suddenly. You know, like if you got hit by a truck full of chamomile tea or something. Like that. <laughs> did you see while you were away? You were reading the papers. Did you follow the presidential race at all? I don't care. I don't care. Really? Whoever wins president, I, you know, be like hanging a under new management sign over a porno theater. That's what I care. What do I care? What do I care? Who is? See, here's the thing. I don't know. When I see the porno theaters under new management, I get concerned. I oh, want to yeah. meet the guy, find out what his deal well, is. Well, we have one now, but, you know, <laughs> who is idiotic enough to want to be president of the United States? Um, who is, you know, we're just, who is arrogant enough to go, hey, you know what the country needs? Me. You know, just... <laughs> uh -huh. but, so, but the news, like, it gets filtered down, you know. Mm -hmm. so, um, so I'm in Hong Kong, mm -hmm. and I read this article. This is what it said. It said that Dole uh, wants to go to war with China over uh, pirated CDs. Dole. He's not even president, nor, you mm -hmm. know, but he wants to go to war. Mm -hmm. That's what you see in Hong Kong. He wants to go over pirated CDs. Like, you know, it's like we used to go to war over oppression or, you know, you know, human rights. Now it's just pirated CDs or what Dole calls intellectual property, you know, which, uh -huh. what the rest of us call crappy Michael Bolton albums. But still, <laughs> you know, I just don't. So that just goes to show you. Just like, we, don't, we just go to you. war, yeah. Now yeah. we just go to war over, like, business deals, you right, know? Right, right. And, uh, because that's what, that must, must be what it's worth, you know? Coke and Pepsi, here's another thing I read. This is about Coke and Pepsi, right? Mm -hmm. This is just to, uh, just to show you how, you know, minute, what we mean in the real scheme of things, us human mm -hmm. beings. Coke and Pepsi, I'm not making this up. I read this. Coke and Pepsi last year spent $8 billion on advertising. Mm -hmm. Eight, $8 billion. Mm -hmm. $8 billion to get you to buy Coke or Pepsi. Coke or, let's see how much effect this has had on you, the consumer. Let's say, you know, you're at the, at the ballpark there at the concession stand. You're, right. hey, give me a couple of hot dogs and a Coke. Oh, sorry, sir, we only have Pepsi. Yeah, whatever. Eight billion. <laughs> yeah. Sir, do you know how many uh, Vietnam veterans it takes to screw in a light bulb? You don't know? Because you weren't there, man! You weren't there! <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, believe it or not, that was Rich Hall's one millionth joke! This is just the beginning of the excitement because right now, Rich, we're going to take a fond look back at oh, your wonderful oh. one million joke career. Enjoy. Oh, really? No. But please. Smile, <laughs> though your heart is aching. Smile even though it's breaking When there are clouds 
in the sky you'll get by if you smile through your fear and sorrow smile and maybe tomorrow you'll find that life is still worthwhile if you Oh, that's my, uh, oh, man. A million jokes. That's really incredible, I huh? remember my... Hold um, it. What's the matter? Hold on, yeah? I'm sorry. Um, we, we checked it. <laughs> <laughs> you sure? All right, I'm... Uh, this is our fault, Rich. I'm sorry. We were going through it today. Uh, you're still 375 jokes shy <laughs> of a million, actually. I'm, I'm sorry. Let's just, uh... You sure? Yeah. Okay, well, let's just uh, then take this... Take care of this right now. I'm well, sorry, that's know. our fault, actually. I'd be we apologize. To, I'd be up, I'd be up, We're up. sorry. Well, anyway, uh, good I, luck with that. No, I, mean, I, I could do another 375 jokes. That's really. okay, we don't have time oh. right now. We're, we're running a little long. We're going to actually... They're quick. Do, yeah, no, we um, got to go. But no. you'll do them some other time, you know? We'll just take care of it right now. We're going to go to commercial Is break. This what? How come if you uh, blow in a dog's face, you know, he hates it, but, you know, as soon as he gets in the car, he sticks his head, like, right out the window? Okay, that's great. Well, then well, you got 374. That's great. We got to go. We're going to go on a commercial right now. We'll be right back with Amy Ray. I'm sorry. Well, I, can do, I, can I apologize. Do. If boxing doesn't cause brain damage, how come they call it a ring when it's clearly a square? You know, see there? All right, 351. Rich. You know. Rich. My grandmother Rich. always said. Rich, we, could you just take that outside, please? We got a show to do. Yeah, can okay, I just take this row? Right here. Come yeah, on, Yeah, you people. can take the row. That's All right, fine. Come on. Just yeah, let's go. Them. Anyway. We got uh, 349 you. jokes. There so, you go. Best you of know, luck with that. My grandmother there you go. always said. Come on. Rich, here we go. everybody. He's getting there. He's chipping away at yeah, it. Yeah, he really is. Late next week, he'll be there.